now we'll take some measurements uh, in uh, units of velocity. Uh, velocity is, will be in RMS and the units are millimeters per second. Now, as you can see on the display of the meter here, we're in class one at the moment and the readings uh, are showing that it's good. Now, if you see at the bottom of the meter here, we do have class one, class two, class three, and class four that we can choose. Uh, we have set on, on class one right now. So we will be looking at uh, readings between 0.28 millimeters per second RMS all the way up to 45 millimeters per second RMS. So let's increase our vibration levels and see what happens. Okay. Uh, right now we're, say, we're seeing that it's good. Okay, our vibration level is good. Okay, 0 0.6, 0 0.7, we're still good. 0 0.9, 1.2. Now you notice it's changed to match with the uh, chart at the bottom. It's satisfactory. Okay, so we keep going. 1.9, 2.1, 2.3, 2.7. Okay, now we've changed to be unsatisfactory. That matches the uh, chart at the bottom. Uh, we keep going. Okay, and uh, we'll reach a point where it'll be unacceptable, which is in the red. Okay, so the meter will automatically um, display your ISO levels for you. Okay, that is how easy it is to use this uh, EN212 meter.